Hey girls, it's Monday. Let's crack down on the challenge. Um, Sammy. Oh, Sammy Joe, what I think of you. Okay. Sammy, if I had to think of any person that you are like, celebrity, character, whatever, um, I pick Joanna Newsom just because you kind of talk like her. I mean that in the nicest way possible. And that thing you wore in your head yesterday, I loved, but that didn't help at all because she wears stuff like that too. And it was cute as can be, I'm not going to lie. But you look like Joanna Newsom. And I, no, it's a good thing. It's a good thing. She's one of the best musicians of all time. Um, though I'm, I'm not going to lie, I'm kind of pissed that she said I look like Ellen DeGeneres. I mean, where would you ever get that idea that I look like Ellen fucking DeGeneres? Just because I'm wearing a sweater vest that she'd wear and a t-shirt that she'd wear and... Because I am attracted to Portia de Rossi. So. But uh, anyways. Nevertheless. Thanks. She's funny. And uh, probably the guy Alan something. I remembered it. But I don't remember it now. Um, I had to look him up. I knew who he was. But I didn't know who he was. I had to look him up. And I'm impressed. Thanks. Emily. If I was to say who you reminded me of. I'd say Hermione Granger because that's easy. She's smart. She's pretty. She goes to a big school, and uh, she's in love with wizards. And that's that basically sums it up for you. I mean, you're smart. You're pretty. You go to a big school, and uh, you're in love with two wizards, or one. I don't. I don't know. I didn't finish those series, and I really regret it. It's on my to-do list. Kayla, Kayla, Kayla. This isn't so much a who you remind me of, but what you remind me of, I guess. And I picked South Park. Because if you recall, at Emily Smurl's 16th birthday party, you know her, right? Um, we played hide and go seek in like this area downtown in a house or a building of sorts. And we hid in a closet. And all we saying while we were in there and no one found us was uh, Trapped in the Closet by R. Kelly. Which we kind of parodied off of South Park, which we kind of made our own and blah, blah, blah. Um, but yeah, you remind me of that. And also you remind me of Sandra Bullock in The Blind Side because sports equals Kayla. And Sandra Bullock in The Blind Side equals sports equals Kayla. So, love it. Nickel, nickel, nickel. This is what you remind me of. And don't take offense to this, I don't mean this in any way, shape, or form in, like, the lesbian matter, because it's never even been confirmed that she is a lesbian, but it's clearly, clearly hinted at. In Charlie Brown, Charlie Brown has a friend named Peppermint Patty, and your hair kind of looks like her hair. And um, you're only Peppermint Patty if Robert Skelton can be Charlie Brown, okay? And for you guys who don't know who Robert Skelton is... I've, I was in English last year with Char with Charlie, with Robert and and Nicole, and they act exactly like Charlie and Peppermint Patty, and more so Lucy and Peppermint Patty, but she looks like Peppermint Patty more. But I'll never call you Sir Nicole. And finally, Briley, yours was kind of easy, um, for me. If you've ever seen Six Feet Under, which I know you have. Um, you remind me a lot of Claire Fisher, just because she takes photographs, and she's kind of moody, but in a good way. Oh, and then also, I totally have to agree with Sammy that you totally remind me of Ellen Page from Whip It. Not Ellen Page from Juno, because if I remember correctly, you didn't ever have a baby in high school. Right? I want summer to be here now. Why is it naughty? Um, I hope you all have a fantastic week. I hope it goes by really fast. I hope you get all your homework done, and it's really easy. You don't have to do a lot of it. And, yeah. I'm totally with Sammy and Briley on the whole let's get tattoos things. Um, I don't know how the rest of you are about it, but, yeah. It would be fun, nevertheless, to watch us get tattoos while you guys were just like, ah, and just filmed it and made fun of us. That'd be fun. Because I 
I actually can handle tattoos, but it hurts. Like, for people who say it doesn't hurt, they're lying. It hurts. Especially if you have to get color and stuff right brightly. Huh. Bye, y'all. Have a fantastic week.